Hi everybody and um, welcome to the first of what I hope to be a series of videos to help you through all this lockdown business that we're all having to go through. Um, I'm going to try and do a song in each one um, from our songbook that we've put together and just kind of show you the parts that uh, you need to put put the whole thing together and um, play through the song as well so you can see how it goes and of course you can play along with it when you when you play this back um, so we're going to start off with how much is that doggy in the window which is just a C okay C and a G7 uh, but the essence of this song really is the fact that it's in a waltz time okay so it's in 3-4 time okay which is counted 1-2-3-2 reason I count it like that is the first number of each count is telling you the bar that it is so one two three is bar one two two three is bar two three two three four two three are three and four as you can probably have guessed already okay um, it's a good way of counting through bars as well eventually you'll just get used to it okay but just keeping that one two three Two, two, three, three, two, three, four, two, three. That gives you that waltz sway, that one, two, three, two, two, three. Okay, that lovely sway. Okay, so um, how do I do it? How do I bring this to life? Because you, the thing is, um, probably when we when we all start, I think, I guess, uh, we all start with these little down strokes. And they're fine. They they'll get they'll get you up and running. But one of the things about just playing down strums like that is you don't know where the first beat of the three is. You don't know where it lives. Okay, it could be any one of these. Could be beat one or beat two or beat three. We don't know. So um, one of the things that you can do is if you want to do it like me is I play a thumb brush technique which is an old guitar technique um, but it's really good at telling the the listener where the one is so I actually brush down I do it with my thumb sorry I, do, I put my thumb down okay to give me a warmer sound on the one and then I do two strums with the forefinger on the nail so it's thumb brush brush thumb brush brush thumb brush brush That just, the difference in texture just tells the listener where the one is. Strange, isn't it, how music works, is that that somehow is in us. Rhythm and music is in all of us. And it's amazing how something like that can just direct um, the listener to, to know where the sway is in, in the song. Fascinating stuff. Okay, so... Without further ado, let's try and put the, the the song song together. So here we go. We'll start off. We'll vamp on the vamp on the C. A vamp is just means you just keep playing until the singing comes in. So here we go. How much is that donkey in the window to the G7? To California and leave my poor sweetheart alone. If she has a dog, she won't be lonesome, and the doggy will have a good home. How much is that? How 
read in the papers there are robbers with flashlights that shine in the dark. My love needs a doggy to protect her and scare them away with one bark. I don't want a I don't want a parrot that talks I don't want a bowl of little fishes She can't take a goldfish for walks How much is that donkey in the window? The one with the waggly tail How much is that donkey in the window I do hope that doggy's for sale Okay Right, so um, pretty straightforward there and you can hear that I'm doing the thumb brush brush thumb brush brush thumb brush brush thumb brush brush also it can be elaborated by bringing little skip beats in like 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 so thumb brush brush and thumb brush brush after you've done the brush brush you do a little skip beat you've got to bring your hand back up anyway to get to the next thumb maneuver so you can kind of just flick off just flick off one or two of the strings so that you get thumb, brush, brush, and, okay? So um, that will just give it a little bit of bounce. Thumb, brush, brush, and thumb, brush. And you can vary vary these things as well. You'll probably find that you'll get some happy accidents along the way where you accidentally hit certain things and you think, oh, that sounds really good. And if you do, then you've discovered something um, to put into your own arsenal of, of how you strum. And it all makes you a richer um, musician, a richer player. So um, there we are. That's How Much Is That Doggy in the Window by Patty Page. A lovely patty page and I wish you a lot of luck with it and if you've got any questions of course please fire away